Hi, I'm Ben. I'm Dustin. Welcome to another edition of JP Enterprise's New Product Showcase. Let's take a look at what's new this month. All right, man, so our module trigger is huge. Everybody loves it. But we, I, I have heard a complaint. The complaint has been, I would like to change from a curved shoe to a straight shoe and then back to a curved shoe, depending on the match, depending on what they're doing, or even guys that want to take their rifle to go shoot PRS, they want to roll, run our roller trigger and then run a flat or a curve during a match. Yep. And so yep. management listen. I mean, they always do. And uh, they're going to sell trigger shoes by themselves. Yeah, and I think it was always part of the plan to have those available, but ultimately, you know, early in production on, on the, the units themselves, you know, you're trying to get as many of the full assemblies out as yeah. possible. But now, you know, we've ramped up enough. We've got the individual trigger shoes available, so you can now swap out, try out one of either the flats or the curved or the roller triggers, depending on what you started with. Or even if you want to upgrade, you got that trigger shoe in black initially. You've added some colored accessories on mm -hmm. there. Now you can go ahead and color match to what your rifle has on it. Uh, it's a really slick setup. It's actually really easy to do. Uh, Sanchez is going to yeah. show us here how that's done. All right, so why don't you uh, pick the trigger shoe you want to run with there? Well, I've got red on my rifle, so I think we should go with the red flat trigger. There. All right. So we'll just take our punch, go into our roll pin here. Just drive that guy out. And we'll just slide her off here. Nice dovetail design, so it's really easy. Yeah. So you have a lot of strength in there. Roll pin just to hold it in place. Take your uh, red flat, slide her on. Take your guide. And it really does make a big difference to have the proper tools, have the proper size punch, and then a roll pin punch to, to hold on to that roll pin as you get it started in the in the trigger shoe. Uh, and, and that goes up, you know, applies for I think just about any gunsmithing that yeah. you're going to do. Make sure to have the right tools. Beautiful. And there we are. Changed up, ready to go. So um, I'm sure we can put down below in the link the uh, proper tools that you need to um, remove and assemble or put on a, a new trigger shoe. Yep, but as you can see, really quick process. Um, get it changed out. You know, try with the roller trigger. There's always guys that ask a lot of questions on those roller triggers, but they're not sure what they're going to think of it. I tell you, I love that roller trigger. So this makes it really easy, you know, low risk to try it out, see how you like it on your gun. I'll be surprised if you switch back to any other uh, trigger shoe, um, you know, unless you want one of the colors, in which case, obviously, you got your options there. Yeah. So, right. yeah. The design is awesome. Like I was saying, um, if I was to shoot PRS, I'd actually want to run, run the uh, roller trigger, yep. and now with the module trigger, I, I'm, I'm just with one trigger, two trigger shoes, I can move on. Well, we're excited to see you out there with that 14 and a half inch ultralight 308 that you keep uh, talking I, about. I, so. might change, I might change uppers to go hang out with you guys, be a little bit more competitive. Perfect. Well, check them out on our website. They're available now. Once again, I'm Ben. I'm Dustin. Thanks again for joining us for this edition of JP Enterprise's new product showcase. Be sure to like and subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and we'll see you guys at the range.